Hey guys, welcome to this vlog. This is day two of sailing on Royal Caribbean International cruise ship from Singapore to cruise to nowhere. And uh, uh, in the room, you get these whatever <laughs> teas. And actually, I got my own tea to the room because I cannot survive without my Indian chai. So these are new Vag Bakri chais which comes with key, uh, tea, solids, milk and sugar. It is ready to make tea and these are much better than the tea bags because it has everything pre-made in solids and dry form. So just need to put hot water and swirl a bit and your tea is ready. So we have used this tea and it was amazing. Tha. Let me know in the comment section below because if you are also like me, if you can't survive without your Indian chai on your holidays, then a big hug to you and try out these chais. And I woke up with a beautiful day. The day was quite sunny. Sunrise ho gaya tha. I missed out the sunrise. But then we headed to the top deck where we have solarium. You have nice sun uh, coming on the couches and you have pool. And here is the calming sea view. This is what I love. I love ocean. I love sea, sand, sun. So this wedding anniversary uh, celebration was so much close to my soul. We headed for breakfast to Wind Jammer, which has multi cuisine international restaurant markets where you can pick up anything, eat unlimited food, and eat as much as you can. So, we tried everything that we wanted. One thing great about this place is that there is something for everybody especially for kids they go crazy over the continental breakfast fruits juices and everything and they will be very happy and if you are like me who loves indian food there is spanish cuisine where i got pav bhaji and dal khichri in the morning which is light to my stomach and good for my tongue and i also tried some fresh fruits they were super sweet and if somebody cuts the fruits and gives me, I will eat them every day. I'm so lazy in cutting fruits, so it was a great experience for us. Uh, we also have milk tetra packs and basically everything, cakes and fruits on the cruise and some Asian noodles and fried rice for my husband. So we chose what we wanted to eat and had a very heavy breakfast because you do get hungry enjoying the cruise. What? walking on the cruise going to different shows and we have a long day planned ahead of us so stay tuned till the end of the vlog so after the breakfast we headed to explore the cruise we were on deck 12 uh, we booked a balcony room in 12th floor so we came down to deck 5th and uh, this was my outfit for the day it was quite sunny and bright in the day we paired all of us into blue shades because i thought it will look lovely like a summery blue sea and i'm wearing my two fist cosmetic summer hat it was quite useful because the sun at the sea hitting on the shores and uh, water is quite reflecting and quite harsh on your eyes and skin so make sure you carry your sunscreen when you're heading on a cruise vacation these are the uh, life boats for emergency so these are all placed on deck five and then we walked across the uh, sea and explored all the things and it was quite hot and the water was reflecting like stars and sprinkles and we then sat down and relaxed a bit because the cruise was really big but it was so calming and peaceful and it looks like there is nobody on the cruise right now other than us because everybody is indoors right now enjoying the activities and watching the shows and having their lunch or breakfast or just chilling in the room or by the pool but we wanted to come here and explore the different sections of the cruise then why not right once you're on the cruise you make sure you check out each and every deck each and every floor then after sitting there for a while and exploring the cruise we headed back to our room changed our outfits outfits and then we headed to the pool and Anika and Ranveer are super excited because finally they got the chance to go to the kids pool here is me it was super hot but for the kids I have to go to the kids pool so Anika was initially a bit shy and scared 
seeing the water and she didn't want to touch the water but her dad took her to water somehow because why not baby you don't have to be scared you have to come and enjoy with your bhaiya so ranveer and anika's dad helped her to play in the pool and within few minutes she was all settled and she started enjoying by herself the kids pool has two sections one is for diaper wearing babies and another for non diaper babies so first anika played in the diaper in section where there is pool because we didn't know that she has to go to the other pool after some time when she was playing in a big kids pool then somebody came and told us that she can go to another small pool where there is only diaper wearing baby pool uh, which is there at the back side anyways we had lot of fun and then we all got exhausted and tired so we went and changed the pool this kids pool area is amazing during the night time there are a lot of lights and bright thing here they switch off the pool completely no water play in the night time but there is good lighting and the cruise looks beautiful so now anika is playing with water and one thing about cruise is that when you're going on a cruise definitely pack your uh, water outfits or pool outfits because there are uh, jacuzzis and there are water play and there are adult pools there is pool bar and restaurant and cafe on the same deck so if you want to have a drink or eat something uh, it will be fun So after the pool time we headed back to the room again had a quick shower and change and went for lunch again to the wind jammer you do have main dining rooms and halls where you can go and have your lunch and dinner but wind jammer was all what all we needed for our kids and for us so we didn't go to the main dining hall and here again we have all the foods whatever you want to eat same like breakfast international cuisines and uh, we got some indian food for ourselves and some yummy cakes and mousses for the kids my son tried some continental so chicken and potato wedges and pastas and more chicken and stuff like that and after the dinner we again had it uh, for some ice cream so there is behind ice cream bar we had ice cream and then uh, this was a swing Uh, where we just had some hangout chilling time then we again went to the top deck of the cruise to enjoy the ocean and the sun and i definitely wore my hat and i think that was the best thing i did because it was so hot i would have completely tanned if i didn't then we had to go to magic hall so we have to pass through a casino so we are passing through the casino the casino was already on so people were playing games and inside the casino this was the ambience you can see there is uh, tables there are a lot of games and uh, if you have money spend it there we did not and then we came out of the casino and we headed to the place where we booked a a uh, towel folding and napkin folding activity the cruise itself was so beautiful like if you just don't do any activities and just walk the cruise each and every corner of the cruise it will be beautiful then this gentleman helped us to catch up with the activity because we missed out a bit in the beginning of the towel folding activity so he helped us and then my husband tried out some of the activities and i told him please do learn this so that once we come back home he can do this for me and our family once in a while so this was quite fun to learn this i think they made teddy bear and a dog and uh, i didn't try any activity because i was so exhausted after the pool and i was also taking care of anika she wanted some cuddle time godi time and milk so i let my husband try uh, the activities and this was fun again we came back to the room and we were so tired and exhausted and it was anika's nap time so we gave her a milk i thought she will cry in the new place but she did not even cry for a one minute time she enjoyed i told her we to take some rest but he wanted to watch some television and uh, in the tv or in the room they show where 
are all the uh, cruise sailing right now and stuff like that so we had another activity this was bollywood dance class and uh, i actually wanted to do this but i don't know after going there i changed my mood i, I instead sent ranveer so he's standing there in the orange t-shirt in the front uh, dancing and uh, Uh, these were basically dance activities some workouts and stuff on the bollywood song but it, this was fun and now i am realizing that i'm missing uh, this thing because i didn't do this at that time finally this is the cruise we came out of that activity and this is how the cruise was looking beautifully done and then we again had to eat something so we went for some more activities after that so there is soccer play bumper cars some digital games some more activities to name a few so and there is also some hot dog bars where you can buy hot dog i mean get hot dogs because it's included in the package so we did that and i think we came for lunch again and this is what i'm eating the best thing about the cruise holiday was that a bright sun a relaxing time a good family time foods always on the table and lot of activities at one place and also exploring the cruise itself there are shopping experiences as well if you are someone who loves shopping but i did not shop anything on this cruise holiday because i was just relaxing and i was just enjoying the food the food was amazing then it was evening and we went to royal theater to watch some shows there were talents from ukraine and uh, the shows were really great and they were family friendly so you can go as a whole family you obviously have to book the shows in advance and secure a slot for yourself because of covid we do have social distancing and protocols in place so we all enjoyed the show and it was great we you do have to wear the mask we just removed it for a photo <laughs> but uh, wearing a mask indoors is mandatory kids had fun too anika sat throughout the show luckily i got her something to munch so that she eats and drinks milk and sleeps that's what happened after watching the show for a while she slept and ranveer enjoyed the show with us and that was great the shows run from evening 7 o'clock to i think 12 o'clock or so and uh, then you if you are going to a show then you miss out on the other show so you have to make sure that you choose the one which suits you and it was great uh, watching all the talents perform and then after the show we had to a place called music hall where they have live band and music we sat there for a time but kids felt bored and then we had to the pool to watch a poolside movie under the stars The movies run by the pool every night. It's also free for anybody to watch. You can grab some uh, drinks or coffee or some snack from the nearby restaurants and sit here and enjoy the movie. Uh, my son watched the movie both the nights. Meanwhile, you can also leave your kids here and walk around if you want. We had a relaxing time here and it was quite nice watching the movie under the star. And Anika was just walking around and enjoying. in front of our eyes and it was a great relaxing experience next day morning i saw the sun rise i did not miss it i got up really early so that i can see the sun rise in the sky and it was spectacular so beautiful the hues in the sky were bright red not orange bright red and seeing the sun rise giving the reflection on the ocean and watching it with my family so beautiful this is what i have come here for <laughs> and ignore my just woke up face not even washed my face yet and i was so happy to see the sun shine on me and see the sea and ocean and i see that colors change and this is what i come here for so it was great watching the sun rise Then after getting ready for the day we headed out again for our breakfast lunch and dinner we had more activities planned for the day today we are going to do napkin folding activity and that was my most favorite activity and we learned a lot actually so i think for the rest of my life uh, i will remember what i learned on the cruise for free and uh, then we had chole bhature hash browns some more 
curd and stuff like you have international cuisine so food is never a issue some egg and crosso and after the breakfast we headed to the music hall where there were more activities so anika was sitting and she was just relaxed the best thing is that throughout the cruise there is ample amount of space so kids can walk around play and all play around and in fact roll on the floor if they want to and it was quite uh, easy to manage kids uh, usually when you go to restaurants it's get difficult to manage kids but i think it was quite safe and easy to manage kids on a cruise and this was my outfit of the day uh, just a dressy look because this is what i thought i will wear for the day and then the uh, napkin folding activities were the activities which were all about how to style your dining table and usually these are done in the restaurants when you go to restaurants they style it under the plates or on the tables so we learned a quite a few things and it was quite fun to learn towel or napkin activities we headed back for lunch to a new restaurant this is 270 and we thought of trying a new restaurant for lunch so we, there were pasta some cookies some juices and everything like sandwiches and stuff like that so we chose to eat some of the things and now i am missing the food that i had on the cruise it was super delicious the cookies were great i think i've never had such delicious cookies ever <laughs> or maybe it's just in the air but yeah the cookies were coconut cookies as well as the chocolate cookies and these were so crunchy and delicious and i'm missing them now and uh, we had a great time the best thing about this place is that you can carry these plates to your room or anywhere in the cruise and eat wherever you want so just grab your food so we headed to a theater where there was live performance i think movies were playing we bought our food there and watched the show later on we did a activity at adventure ocean where ranveer won this royal caribbean logo lunch box and also a hat anika was sleeping but since we have two kids so they gave two uh, gifts for the family and the activities was all about exploring the cruise luckily i take lot of pictures and videos throughout my travel so i don't have to run throughout the cruise when i had to answer the questions on the uh, contest i just watched all my videos and photos and answered and we got through it and we won then my husband tried this soft archery and it was fun even my son tried it so it was a huge amount of uh, activities on the cruise you will definitely get exhausted walking around the cruise registering yourself and doing the activities and exploring actually you learn a lot on a cruise because there are a lot of things which we haven't done before in life and we got to do when we are on a cruise so that was great and the best thing was that children had so much to do 
that kept them busy so it was so fruitful it was our 12th wedding anniversary and we planned a cruise so it is checked off our bucket list and when we came back to the room we had all the departure information on our room a day before so if you want to give some tip to your room attendant there was an envelope and also you can tag your bags uh, and a night before they will take them off your load and then it was again the dinner time and Anika look at her she loves her glasses she was excited that lady was asking for her glasses but she refused to give and we had more and more of food and she enjoyed her food I mean she loves to eat by herself so it gets little messy at times but I'm still okay because she enjoys her food I can clean her up later on so that's it guys it was a great experience I would definitely say it's value for money and time and it is great bonding time for family as well the food is the highlight of the experience I loved it and then we headed again for the activity so Ranbir did rock climbing again and this time he did ring the bell he reached till the kids bell which is in the middle of the wall and he completed this task so that was great and after Ranbir my husband also tried it I did not try rock climbing because I got my nails manicure done and I have long nails so I might get hurt because for activities like this it's better you don't have nails because it might you might hurt yourself but it was fun seeing Ranveer do the activity in hot sun it was super hot this was around two o'clock in the afternoon but he completed his kids uh, rock climbing and it was so so fun yeah also tried rock climbing and he also completed the whole track actually his was much difficult than the other two walls because this wall is curved on the top so your chances of falling out of this wall is much higher because it is curved so it was quite difficult to hold the walls or the rocks and also my husband is heavy so but he completed this I think I'm so proud of it because it was his first rock climbing also and he went till the top and rang the bell so it was so so fun. And again in the evening we had a two some uh, shows because that is what all happens on the cruise in the evening you have a lot of relaxing activities where you have to just sit and enjoy the entertainment programs and during the day you can do all the activities and involve yourself physically and mentally so we had to watch the show and it was quite good actually they, these were international shows so you get to see the talents live perform and I think it was a good experience and after the show uh, we had it for some quick snack and then by the pool there was movie so we watched the movie and enjoy it under the stars so after a quite relaxing time on the cruise it was time to head back to the room and also pack our luggage and send it for the disembarkation because if you want to give away your heavy luggage a night before you have to keep it out of your room a night before so they will help you to receive it at the cruise center the next day and that makes the overall cruise experience journey easy I got some lollipops and candies for Anika from home and they can be carried easily for kids there are no restrictions on those and she enjoyed that
it guys this was our two vlogs of singapore royal caribbean cruise i hope you guys enjoyed we had great time celebrating our wedding anniversary on the cruise and uh, it is great experience sharing our little life vlogs with you all on here on super princess joe youtube channel if you liked these vlogs please make sure you give them a thumbs up and subscribe to my youtube channel i will see you very soon in my next vlog thank you so much for watching bye